hello guys welcome back to my channel is our 14th XHTML or HTML tutorial and in this tutorial we are again working with the forms so let's start the first task we'll, which we will perform today is to make a border around our form so for example let's let me show you uh, you know for example I want to see you know all these text boxes inside a border so that I can name my form, you know, write a little bit, you know, the intro, yeah, what the name of the form, which will be displayed to the end user, or the person who will be, you know, visiting your website. So, let's make a border around this, you know, these, all these five text boxes. So, let's go. Okay, to make a border around your form, first of all, you have to make you know whatever the elements of your form are within a field set you know only that is the that is the option that we can use to you know in border all these elements so so let's let's go so use the field set tag before the first element in your form so for that purpose let's go with a field set okay guys so field set you have to close the tag as well but remember before the form closing okay field set so now save it and you might see a little bit border around your you know around your form elements so let's make give it a, a title so to give the title of to the field set we use the legend legend tag and then close the tag you know this legend tag almost do the same thing with the title tag here you can see in the head you know it does so it gives the title to the you know html web page so really which will is you know is shown in the tab bar so the working of field set uh, legend is pretty much same as the title tag so let's give it a title we we'll use sign up form sign up form okay form save it and let's see as you can see the title has been appeared on the top of the elements on the border around the element so let's see if you want you know the field set is just too much longer than the actual size of the element so for that purpose okay <coughs> the answer is no in HTML but for that purpose you have to use the inline CSS which is a good thing but maybe a little bit too early so let's let's not worry about let's go give a style equal to double quotes width semi colon none of colon okay here we go colon with a colon you know remember the up rule is same css does not have you know recognize the equal sign it has the colon sign so save it and you, as you can see the border of the field set has been you know decrease to what we can let's go with a little bit you know smaller one let's go with 460 okay save it uh, almost done almost done so really good all the you know all the elements you know they and uh, very very gorgeous looking let's now for example I want to you know this sign up form here yeah, this legend I want to be in the middle so let's make it possible go with in the legend tag go in the legend tag write an attribute align okay center save it refresh and you can see now the legend has been in the middle our field set so that's it for this tutorial keep subscribe to learn more 
you can follow us youtube daily motion twitter facebook google plus okay take care goodbye and keep subscribed to be learn more and updated